Um, so our, our next question is that often as young ministers and kind of representative of the under 40 group, we're asked why young people don't come to church anymore. And so I'm wondering if you, you've been asked that question and what your responses are. Um, <laughs> Robin may have a few answers to that too. Um, I think the first thing is um, don't ask people to be on committees. Um, more and more, especially a lot of my friends who work more in the co corporate culture, there is a push within work for it to be everything. So you're expected to be on committees at work, you're expected to go to the charity things at work, you're expected to do all those things. And so when you walk into the door of the church, it just, you don't, it's, it needs to be a place of respite, a place of rest. Um, recently, two members of my congregation who joined, um, they said they were looking for some stability in their crazy life. They have twins who are three years old. Uh, they have hockey practice. They're both practicing lawyers. They live in the city, and they were looking for that sense of stability. Um, I think tradition actually is important because so many of us have grown up. I mean, you guys are exceptions, but I know for me, my mom always fondly talked about um, growing up one thing she did enjoy about her Catholic upbringing was all of her friends were Catholic. They had this tradition. She knew her identity. My generation, we don't know our, who we are, and the church can be a place to give that sense of foundation. Um, so don't ask them to be on committees. Let them be. Uh, they might sit in the back for about a month, um, if you remember, or a year even, and showing up once a month is regular church attendance. Uh, once a month is considered regular, I think, now. So that would be my best advice. And yeah, that's what I think. Mm -hmm. I always think that question's the wrong, wrong way around. Yeah. Um, so it used to be that everyone went to church, so that's what you did. You went to church. And the question isn't, why aren't people coming to church anymore? It's, why should anyone come to church? Why come to church? It's no longer something that we have to do. So there has to be a reason that we make this choice in our busy lives. And wherever we are, our lives are busy. I was in Concarden and people with families there had incredibly busy lives. So why are young people choosing to go to church? Um, my working theory is that there's three reasons. The first one is community. The second is the ability to engage in uh, social justice work or outreach work of some kind that they find meaningful. And the third one is that it offers a safe place to ask faith questions. I, so I've asked a lot of young adults why they've gone to church, and these are the three themes that I've heard, um, and it's different for different people or weighted differently for different people. But for me, these three themes then offer us important questions about how we approach relating to young people um, and how we try to, as we, as we get to our theme for the afternoon, how we try to preach to young people, how are we preaching in ways that engage these three needs that church can meet in a way that the rest of our lives can't necessarily. I'm going to add a comment just because I have to admit I get this question less and less that people ask me, well, as a young person, <laughs> why, uh, why aren't people coming to church or how would you get people to come to church? So I don't know what that says. But anyway, um, but I have to say my honest response to many of those people has been, I don't know, I'm here. Like, and I'm right here in front of you as a young person, as part of this community, and you're asking me why I'm not here, but I am here. So that... I've always found a bit othering. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. And, and I, I don't know if you guys have got this, but I also get people saying, well, with a young minister, more young people will start coming to church now. Um, that has never been my experience. I've never had someone just show up and start attending because of my age. I think people come because they find something meaningful. And it doesn't matter what your age is, whether you can offer something meaningful. Now, I, I think there's an argument to be made for fostering a community of people who are young adults so that when you show up at a congregation, you don't feel like you're the only one who's not a grandparent. But that's not, that in itself isn't enough. 
I think it's important for a sense of connection and feeling like you belong, but it, it isn't the answer, just having some other young people there. <laughs>